helping showcase Native American artists. Coming up, meet the gallery owner who's making history in the gas lamp and exposing new people to indigenous culture. November is Native American Heritage Month. San Diego County has the largest number of tribal governments and reservations in the U.S. And here at ABC 10 News, we're committed to celebrating that rich history and culture. Anchor Lindsay Pena begins the first in a series of stories this month about our local Native American people. In the heart of San Diego's Gas Lamp District is the exclusive collections gallery, the first Native American individually owned business in the area. I'm really excited to, you know, represent our people. It's also a little sad that it's taken us this long, but, you know, here we are. Ruth Ann Thorne is the gallery's founder and proud member of the Rincon Band of Luceno Indians. A fixture in the San Diego art scene for some time now, she's passionate about being an ambassador for the creative. Artists for everyone is really our tagline, and that means that we want to expose people to a lot of different styles. Featured prominently here is the work of Native American artists from all over the country, like Jeremy Salazar. He grew up on the Navajo Reservation. His father is an artist, and he utilized his art really to feed his family. I had never seen anything that was so detailed and it's almost like it's realistic, but it's also very contemporary. And George Rivera. It's one of the few stainless steel castings I've ever seen. It refers to the Lakota tribe or the Dakota tribe who were overtaken by the colonies by killing off millions of buffaloes. Um, Thorne says kind of the gallery the enables her to share what Native American art really is, not what people think it is. We are a modern day people, so we have artists that are coming in, still holding on to their culture, but bringing in contemporary views of that art. And she'll get to do that on a larger scale later this month when the gallery hosts the fourth annual Native American Art Show for the first time in their new location. We have a huge group of Native of people like the top of all of the different genres of art, painting, sculpture. We even have an artist that takes these tin cans and makes baskets, California native baskets out of them. Her hope is to give those creators a platform and enable meaningful interactions. A lot of these artists take their proceeds back to their tribes and they, you know, feed their tribes and bring water and those types of things. And then also for the people to come and be able to participate that and learn about the first people so that there can be an understanding and there can be a bridge. And that's what the arts have always done historically. Lindsay Pena, ABC 10 News. The Native American Art Show at the exclusive Collections Gallery in the Gas Lamp happens November 10th through the 12th, Friday and Saturday from 6 to 9 p.m. Sunday from 1 to 4. Everyone is welcome. Admission is free.